Hello, Collective. Welcome to Collectively Chosen. It is Miss Kelly coming to you with your what you need to know message. Collective. Let's start off with it. The sun, okay? You get no brighter than this. Happiest card in the deck, okay? Um, I do feel like somebody here could be worried. Like, why is the Collective so happy? Okay? Even though you could have a lot on your plate, all right? All right, this is a time for you to stand up for yourself with the seven of wands, okay? Um, I do feel like you could have people possibly trying to burden you with their issues. Thank you, Ace of Swords. What I'm telling you is the truth. Possibly trying to burden you with their issues, but this is a time for you to set boundaries and stand your ground, okay? Oh, what else for the collective? All right, so we have the three of cups. Happiness, celebration, friendships, okay? Um, some of you may be getting ready to get out, all right? And you feel like you may need to get out and really relax, relate, release, okay? Um, just get out and have some fun. Yes, look, wow. So this keeps coming out together, okay? So whatever it is that you may, for some of you that you may be worried about, or this could be someone else, okay? Could be something going on with finances here for some of you. All right. I do feel like there will be light at the end of the tunnel is what I just heard. All right. So this is calling for you to plan. Be a bit more meticulous, especially when it comes to your finances. All right. Um, some of you, you need to calm your thoughts with the six of swords. Okay. Calm your thoughts. All right. There could be some sort of heartbreak I see here. So some of you, there could be a breakup here. Um. Whereas, though, this could be like a family situation where there's finances involved, all right? And you may be worried about, like, what's going to happen afterwards. Take that how it resonates for you. Knight of Pentacles, okay? All right, the King of Wands and the Hangman. So, some of you, there's someone that's coming towards you or there's someone that you are making a plan to go towards, okay? Um, there's some, there's a... a Hmm, starting in the six of wands. Star reverse in the six of wands. That's a bit conflicting. Okay, we got the star and the reverse and then the two. Ooh, okay. So somebody here is not feeling so hopeful about um a decision or what path they're going on. Why is the hangman here? Why is the hangman here? Seven of cups in the reverse. Six of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay. The star in the reverse. Somebody's losing hope here. I don't know. For some of you, somebody could be watching you possibly online. All right. Or doing some sort of research. They could be manifesting you as well. All right. Somebody here wants some sort of give and take with you. But I feel like they feel as though you're not giving and receiving with them. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, this is someone I don't feel like that the past was too... Uh, too great for you all, all right? Something could have been revealed to you, okay? With the Hermit and the Seven of Swords and the Reverse. Something could have definitely been revealed here to you. Why is the Six of Cups in the Reverse? And so you got 766 could be, uh, you can look up the angel number, 766. Could be significant, Ten of Swords, Two of Pentacles. Okay, so someone possibly backstabbed and betrayed you. In the past. So what are they playing? What is this? Okay. Alright, we have the magician and then the death. Oh, I don't like that. Seven of Swords reverse. Somebody could have wished death on someone here. What the fuck? No. You're not doing that. <laughs> okay. You're not doing that. Um Knight of Swords. Seven of Swords. Something could come out here. Something reckless. Some sort of reckless action. Okay. Somebody regrets some sort of reckless action here. Somebody feels like, oh. Somebody feels like you're a badass collective. So, okay. The justice in the reverse. Somebody feels as though they did you wrong. 
This is a past. This is somebody that could have been a lover. Or somebody feels like somebody did something unjust to someone here. All right. Let's see what we can get on this. All right. We have the fool. I feel like somebody is feeling foolish about something here. Quite foolish. Justice in the reverse. All right, we have Divine Feminine and Praying. Mm. Sweet Talk in the reverse. Okay, so somebody could be upset that they're, they're not able to sweet talk you. Somebody could be shocked by something that they saw. What, what, what is this Praying? And Divine Feminine. Praying Divine Feminine. All right, we have true colors. Justice in the reverse. Okay, so something... Well, somebody could have left someone hanging. Or maybe not so much. Side hustle in the reverse. And then coping. This is weird. So something seems to have, let's see, watch two colors here. All right, running. Fake busy in the reverse. Then we have fairy tale. All right, something is like a love-hate situation between you and someone. All right, somebody here could feel like a jackass. Okay, uh, somebody's having some sort of awakening as well. Some sort of ego death. So somebody here is coming out of some sort of a bad, um, some sort of bad debt, bad credit, or there could be some sort of karmic debt, spiritual debt, possibly here that I'm seeing. Okay, we have Shady and then Trap. Secret. So somebody, some some sort of secret came out. What is, what is this? All right. Uh, getting reading in reverse, and then we have self love. All right. So oh, hmm. interesting love message. So somebody, I feel like, is definitely paying off some sort of karmic debt. So something that somebody was worried about, like, I feel like some sort of karmic debt is being paid off here. Let's see, what else collectors? Six of Cups reverse, Six of Pentacles reverse. We have Jealous One in the reverse, okay? Um, someone didn't possibly protect you in the past, okay, collective? All right, we have unfoldment, spiritual awakening, breaking free and blooming, connecting with higher self. All right, um, hmm. use your head, give it some thought, think logically and rationally. Don't let emotions control you. And then we have the Empress, highly desirable, reclaim your power. So your past does not define you, um, collective. Infinite abundance of communication, okay, um, some of you may need to clarify something. This could be even something dealing with paperwork, I just heard. All right. So something is coming in. Okay. Complexity, situ situationship, tricky situation, hard to figure out. So there could have been a situation where uh could have been with a king of wands. Something could have been very complex. Okay. Um, we have temptation. Someone could have definitely came in and tempted someone at some point. All right. Collector of hearts. All right, somebody could look at you collective as a heartbreaker or someone that you were dealing with could have been in that energy. Take it how it resonates for you. All right, but give me something on true colors. True colors. <clears throat> Ooh, a long list. Ooh. 
so collective. Somebody feels as though like you were very high maintenance or you're very high maintenance or you have a long list of options. You're someone that they feel like maybe you like variety. You maybe don't, they may look at you as a type who don't like to settle down. Okay, is what I'm saying here. All right, we did have Divine Feminine. All right, wasting time in the reverse, okay? So somebody wants you to know you will not be wasting your time, all right? Um, this is someone I feel like they're not trying to sweet talk you, whoever this is. I feel like someone is genuinely wanting to come in, okay? Somebody here feels as though time is running out in a situation, all right? Somebody's losing patience here, lighting the way, setting example, setting strong boundaries, okay? Um... And then we have communication. So somebody here wants to communicate with you. They're going to take some sort of action to come towards you. All right. I do see infinite abundance and soul family. So some of you are definitely attracting your tribe in this time. All right. So you're noticing that the people who are meant to leave your life are leaving. And the people who are meant to stay are staying. The devil's domain. All right. So be mindful of people who are codependent on you or your energy okay and then we have the cosmos and safe place feels like home sense of security comfort zone all right so there's something creatively that you need to definitely be working on okay um we do have here this left out in the cold so somebody's feeling like this five of uh five of pentacles energy social circle grasp of greed okay um some of you may be meeting new people all right just be careful of the type of people that you are allowing in your energy okay that's all i'm saying with that just be mindful of the people that you're allowing in your energy <coughs> <coughs> oh excuse me all right the unexpected. So you have surprises that are getting ready to come through for you. We have the young and daydreaming. Okay. So some of you, you could be still in this energy of doing some inner childhood healing. Or this could be the person that you're dealing with or connecting with. All right. Take it how it resonates. But yeah. Collective, somebody sees you as someone who has a lot of options, okay? Um, someone knows that you're not easily swayed, easily tempted, all right? Somebody here wants you to um, possibly, like, I guess, bite the apple, but you're not doing so, okay? Yeah, let's just say somebody here feels as though you're not easily swayed, okay? So, they think there's some sweet nothings that get you going. Absolutely not. Okay. Mm-mm. Hmm. Let's see what else. Let's see, what is this Ace of Swords? Eight of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. Something about work. Ace of Wands. Hmm. Hierophant's cross. All right, some of you could realize that somebody here, I don't know, somebody may have come off like they wanted some sort of connection or relationship or something here, but I feel like it's like they're half in, half out. But I feel like this is something, yeah, that you're done with, Okay. Mm-hmm. I feel like some of you, somebody's coming towards you, okay? Ooh, King of Cups and the Knight of... I mean, the King of Swords and the Reverse. Mm, don't like this. 
Ace of Pentacles. And then we have the Four of Wands. All right. Okay. High Priest in the reverse. Temperance in the reverse. The Moon in the reverse. Yeah, something came out. Okay. Um, For some of you, I don't know. I'm for uh, this may not be for everybody, but I am getting some same sex energy here. All right, Ace of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. So somebody could be doing something here for money. Okay, Five of Wands, Two of Wands in the reverse. Some sort of delays here. Okay, it's quite a few masculines here. All right, this could be the intimidation that someone feels. Um, like I say, somebody feels like you have a lot of options, collective, okay? Uh, and they feel like that's possibly what stands in you all the way, all right? You have a lot of people fighting for your attention, and that could be what's delaying this person from coming towards you. Yep, look, eight of, eight of swords, and this person could also feel like you could be kind of straightforward, all right? We have the moon and the temperance, and then we have the seven of... So it's moon temperance. Five of swords in the reverse, okay? So I feel like your ancestors and guys, they're not allowing anything to come towards you, all right? That is not for your highest good or that's not uh, going to be wish fulfillment for you, all right? You are being protected at this time. Um, some of you are actually being cloaked, okay? Uh, somebody is trying to... Find out some information online. So somebody could definitely be looking up some sort of information online here. Thank you. Yeah, the star in the reverse. Could be an Aquarius. All right, somebody that you've separated from. All right, look, Ten of Swords. Yep. Knight of Cups in the reverse and the Seven of Pentacles. Some of you, you've been waiting on an apology from someone here. Yeah, the tower and the nine of pentacles, high priestess, and the seven of wands. Yeah, mm -mm. four swords, and then the eight of cups in the reverse. Okay, somebody's trying to figure out how can they get you to not walk away. Okay, uh, somebody is really missing you. All right, and they're kind of bummed, yeah, that thank you, confirmation. They're kind of bummed that you don't want to work with them any longer. You don't want to collaborate. You don't want anything. Ooh, yeah, what I tell you? You don't want anything. <laughs> Queen of Cups Reverse is dead with the death card. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, yeah. Look at that, what I tell you. Uh, somebody feels like you could be very, very blunt with your words, okay? Uh, collective, you know, words do hurt sometimes. <laughs> People can feel like you are very blunt with your uh, with your wording. But shit, from what I see, so are they. Shit, even to the point they could be a bit reckless with their mouth. So, you can take, you can dish it, but they can't take it. They can dish it, but they can't take it. <sighs> it is what it is, babe. It is what it is. They could dish it, but they can't take it. Someone is upset because I feel like, too, like they wanted you to fake, fake it. Tell them, collector, we don't need fake orgasms, baby. You will know you ain't hitting that spot. <laughs> okay, tell them, collective, you will know, baby, because it's going to be silence in the room. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tell them, collective is gonna be silence in the room. All right, let's get you a ooh, 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 ooh. Not the middle finger. Give him the finger. Uh. <laughs> Wait a minute, collective. Okay, we got more for the last. Okay, overshares on the reverse, so. That's the thing. People don't know what you got going on right now. Uh, collective. But I feel like this, yeah. Sorry, y'all. My deck was a little on the weird side. 
We started all upside down. Let's see. So, yeah, starving for attention. So, this is someone that they talk. They just, oof. Mouthful of lies. They overshare. This is the type of person they sell all their little business. Okay. They're very childish. All right. Self-obsessed. They only think about themselves. This is someone they starve for attention. They crave attention. And they'll do whatever they got to do to get it. Okay. They really do. Um, they're dragging their, dragging their feet and trying to have a commitment. But they're going to try to come out and say, oh, I've changed. All right. Collective say, look, I don't shit where I eat, baby. All right. Resourceful in the reverse. Somebody here, they're not going to bring anything to your table. Karma is a bitch. All right. Somebody here had a mob mentality. So it could have been a group of people. All right. That could have been spreading some sort of lies. All right. Somebody was set up to fail. And I feel like they're realizing it. Okay. This cat got nine lives wasting your time. So you realize, honey, something was just, it, it just wasn't what it was supposed to it, it wasn't, it wasn't giving. Yeah, somebody wanted you to be a doormat here, okay? And you just, you wasn't going for it, collective. I like to say doormat what? Okay, playing hooky. Thank you. Imposter. They wanted to make it seem like something was so good. <clears throat> Someone is banking on you not trusting your intuition. And you settling for them, okay? Collective, yeah, whoever this is, uh, string you along. So this is somebody I feel like too, excuse me, who could be a bit of a gaslighter. Um, like one moment, this person could want to be all nice in your face, all charming. And, and you know, that's why I feel like that King of Cups, that uh, King of Cups, King of Swords in the reverse comes out. Okay, with this whole thing, uh, where did it go? Where did it go? Um, where it's like one minute they want to play nice and act like they're so endearing. Yeah, yeah, act like they're so endearing and all that old stuff. And then the next breath, you know what I'm saying? They want to be kind of dismissive, act like you don't matter. They ain't messing with you. But this could be like when they get around people and shit like that. So I don't know. I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't tolerate it. I wouldn't tolerate it, not even a little bit collective. If someone like I said they ain't they can't provide no resources, okay? Yeah, somebody could be very pissed off because you hit the brakes. They thought you were some sort of doormat and you had to show them, baby, it ain't sweet. Yeah, look, and I don't need you, okay? So this could have made someone very upset, all right, that... They thought they were making you empty promises and they thought they were sugarcoating things. And the whole time, honey, you could have told this person, like, baby, look, it's, it, you, it's cute and everything. Like, you ain't got a lot of kick it. It's not that serious. <laughs> okay, look, it is so not that serious. Like, you or this situation is just not that serious. Yeah, so I feel like, mm-hmm. Oh, somebody here rolling in their grave? What is this? What's that about? All right, uh, bring him back to life. This cat got nine lives, okay. Well, I don't know. Why well, I feel like somebody's energy, somebody's coming. Mm, secret crush. Somebody who could have passed on. Hmm. I don't know why I'm hearing that. Like, could be trying to make their way to, I don't know, to you. I don't know if it's in a dream or make it towards this mob, something here. Okay, we have Encore, Trust Your Intuition. But it came out in the reverse. What does this rolling in a grave bring back to life? Aiding and abetting. Childish behavior, self-obsessed is in the reverse. And what's this? Backstabber in the reverse. Okay, so someone, um, I don't know, whoever this is, this person, this could have been some of the lies that someone was telling on you, haunted by the past. All right, and something could be moving quite quickly. Maybe in the past you moved really quick in things, 
Karma's a bitch, all right? Somebody needs to choose a path here. <clears throat> Yeah, some of you, you're going to dismiss somebody who's laying it on a little too thick and, uh, okay. Some of y'all just heard, you look at somebody here like a crash test dummy, okay? Um, this is somebody who, like, they will crash and burn. As, uh, my son always talk about some damn, guess this is the new little lingo. I crash out. Yeah, this is somebody who crash out, but I don't feel like they crash out for a good cause. <laughs> Let me just say that. Okay? Um, stringing you along. So, again, somebody's going to come back and, um, Spirit is saying, do not go easy on them. Okay? They want you to, but do not. You deserve to be in that energy. Yeah, because this person is trying to set you up to fail. This is also the type of person, they inflict pain on themselves. Okay? Um, they may not be getting opportunities at this time. Things, doors may have been closed uh have maybe close to them right now okay and then we have wasting your time unrequited love so something here is just not it okay you're somebody here's just not it cautious in the reverse all right um i feel like you just feel as though there's nothing for you to be cautious about because you see this person for exactly who they are okay and you know at the end of the day what you would be settling so i feel like a lot of you you just realize, and some of you, this is somebody, I don't even think things really got off the ground real good. All right, this could be someone that they just always come at you with this passion stuff. And you just like, what else do you have to bring to the table besides passion? Like, okay, like for real. Yeah, you feel like this person is trying to just throw you off path, uh, have, you know, delays, okay? Yeah, but we have calm as a bed, sugar coating. And then we have truth lives. We have some aiding and abetting. Self-obsessed and reverse leveling up. Okay, so you are not your past collector. Again, like I say, somebody here. Um, somebody could dish a lot of energy towards you, but they damn sure can't take it when you dish it back. <clears throat> and that sounds like a personal problem to me. Excuse me. It really does. Sounds like a pee-pee. Sounds like a pee-pee. Personal problem. Oh, yeah, 28. All right, let's get a check-in right quick. There are things I wish I had told you. I want to talk to you, but I don't know what to say. This person is unsure whether they should reach out to you. You're making things harder than they need to be. Somebody feels like you can be, make things a little bit more simple, okay? I know more than you think I know about you and your situation. Oh, okay. And then we have, I give up, let go. So somebody could be letting something go here. All right. Um, I want to start over. And then we have here, I still feel stuck in this and I want to free myself. So somebody still feels some sort of uh, connection to you. I feel like I gave you every chance I could. We tried, I did, disappointed. Okay, so somebody feels like there's just something that just, it's no, it's no point at this point. I am truly sorry. So someone is very apologetic for something here. Look, I told you, we both... Walked away for our own reasons. No one won here. Have you forgotten about me? I think of you every single day. Missing you. I tell you, somebody misses you. This was the real thing I know now. So somebody knows that they were blind to what was in front of them. And I feel like it's 
too late because someone here doesn't feel the same way. Collective, Lord of the Records. The archive of your soul information is open and ready for you to access. You can now align more deeply with your soul purpose. Okay, some of you, it could be music. All right, you may find yourself diving or delving into music. Um, some of you, you may be musicians. Okay, some of you, you may get ready to tap into some sort of musical gift that you have. Mind, heart, and will. Allow yourself to exist through all your dimensional layers. Think freely, feel deeply, and live fully. All right, we have masters, teachers, and loved ones. You are being guided by the divine. Allow your heart space to open and trust that we are here with you every step of the way. And then we have patience. Not all will awaken at the same rate. Be patient and hold space for those who really need your guidance. Okay, and then we have divine blueprint. You are unlocking the sacred knowledge embedded in your DNA from your cosmic guardians. I'm not going to lie to you. Funny enough, I believe that's the last reading that I did for the channel. Okay, illumination, shine your light upon those who cannot see. Okay, so you do. You have people who, they are blind to what they could really attain in this lifetime. Okay, um, you know, some people don't believe in, you know, miracles and good things happening and things of that nature. But um, Spirit is saying, you be the light, okay, in the darkness. Cosmic wounds, seek connection with oneself. As you are a source, are a source of empowerment and of life. In here lies your divine insight. And then we have, uh, you are creation itself. You can reach anyone at any time with your pure source light without taking any residual energy on. Okay, so this is crystalline spirit. So a lot of you, you are a crystalline spirit. All right, so you can help and um, assist humanity in a lot of ways to where though you don't necessarily have to take on other people's energy all right a lot of you could be learning this or you need to learn this all right optimal self dense energies must be left behind in order for you to align with higher frequencies so this is you um disassociating yourself with lower frequencies okay um not saying that you can't deal with them at all but you know you have to protect yourself protect your energy because you spending too much time with those frequencies and energies. And yes, it will dim your light. Collective. It will dim your light. And honey, you are too bright for that, babes. Period. You are too bright for that. All right. And then we're going to get some oracle, I mean, some um, fortunes. And then we're out of here, collective. I hope you all had a wonderful week, okay? Three, three, three on the timer. Thirty, three, thirty, three. What do you have for the collective? to close out thank you pause and reflect be mindful of your self-talk and solve the prop solve your problems with the fullest mental clarity center stage you're not meant to be on the sidelines let your wishes and dreams take center stage Next level, if you leave your comfort zone, you will see accelerated growth and change. All right, we have thwarted plans. Sharpen your will and persevere. It will not cause any long-term negative consequences. Thank you. We have good gossip. Your reputation is very good at this time. Or you're being talked about in a very positive way. Okay. Now with communication, be open to receiving messages right now. It is important to communicate clearly and honestly. All right. Any calls, text messages that you may get, any communications. All right. Resurrection. 
Shake off the past and rise again. Reinvent yourself and you will rise up from the ashes even more powerful. So this is about you finding that spark within yourself, uh, collective. Crystal clear. It is time to see your life and its limitless potential without seeing through rose-tinted glasses. All right. So you got this. I really feel like you have this. Community. Good time to make new connections. The universe may send some beneficial alliances your way. All right. Wow, okay. And good gossip came out again. Okay. So you have good people. Uh, people talking very highly about you, Collective. People are seeing you in a very good light right now. We have encounter. An unexpected encounter will slowly alter the course of your life. Keep an open mind. You're going to meet someone who's going to... <coughs> Excuse me. Possibly change your life or you change theirs. Take it how it resonates for you. Oh, that doesn't go there. For you, collective. All right, let's get you um some fortunes. All right, what fortunes do you have for the collective to close out this reading? Please and thank you. What fortunes? Can the collective expect? What do they need to know? What does the collective need to know? All right, we have you are loved by real people. Money is left to you by someone passing away. You worry over small matters. Okay. Guests coming means trouble. Be mindful of that collective. Your advice is appreciated. And then we have here, you have very good friends. And then we have guard against losses in the future. Okay, what's this? Okay. Wealth inherited from an unexpected quarter. Some of y'all, there's some money. They're not, okay, money coming in. Hurry through with your ideas. You will be successful. Uh, okay, so success in business is in store for you. So for those of you that are in business, success is in store. I hope these messages helped you in some way, shape, or form. Okay, my wonderful collective. I appreciate all the love and support. Thank you to all my new subs and all my... Let's see. Because I don't want love is laying. This is my loyal lovers. I got to come up with something. Okay. My chosen ones. But I'm going to come up with something. And we're going to think on it. If you guys and gals have any ideas, drop it in the comments section. Okay? Please hit that like, share, subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified when there are new uploads. Um, I'm sorry about the timing of... Uh, it, it, it's been a lot going on the past week. Um, even my kids was like, Mom, you had a really uh, off kind of week. So, we get it. And, you know, they said, you'll collect, they'll understand, uh, you know, the channel will understand. And I was like, you know, hopefully they do. But, yeah, it, it's been, it's been a very weird week, okay? This full moon has been full mooning. So, I love you guys and gals, and I will see you all in your next read. Thank you again for your love and support and your patience waiting for these readings to come out. And I will see you in your next one. Peace.